Sup mates, it's Mally. I'm back with another episode of Shadows of Rose. Last we left out, we found out that Michael is actually Etan. And I called that ages ago. So now we're picking up with that. We're probably gonna end up at the reservoir again because we've walked through all the other Lord's houses. So I mean, why the fuck not? At least Donna's was a little bit new. So let's just get on into this. We're not gonna have Ethan though, apparently. Let me just quickly save again. Any longer, apparently though. Because I guess that was his little last bit was to defend us against Evelyn, so we'll see what happens. We're not doing great on supplies, but you know, this is normal. I just want you to... Okay, <laughs> let's calm down a little bit. I don't need to get that just yet. We'll handgun it. I still want answers though, like why? Why is the Duke still acting like that? It doesn't make any sense. Anyway, we should still have the key. What's all this doing out here? Oh, wait. That's a door. We don't need a key. I don't know, okay? Evelyn's got, like, a personal vendetta against you, which doesn't surprise me, but yeah. Okay, handgun ammo. Not what I wanted, but sure. Wait, are we going to the village? Okay, there are the dolls. There's the Evelyn doll. It can't be. We're meant to go see Sal. Or I guess Sal's place. This is a lot of handgun ammo. I need shotgun ammo, please. Uh, okay. Well, you know, it's fine. It's fine. All of this is fine. This is not traumatizing at all. Still on answers. There was a basset. What the fuck is that? It's more my seat. You gonna see Miranda at all? Because it is her memory. What is that? Where I got questions. Hell am I? What is this place? Oh, what the? Oh my... Whoa. There's multiple floating orbs. Okay, there's the castle. There's my wifey's place. I miss her. I guess we came from Donna's little patch. Yeah, this was the village. I don't know what the fuck happened. How twisted did these memories get? Come on. Let's just keep going. How much we can do. We're not going to run into lichens, I don't think. That would be weird. Head for the giant core. Ooh, ooh, easy, 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 easy. Is that me again? All right, let's go say hi. Hello, other version of me. Fuck off, crows. Yeah, Miranda's got friends. Fuck Mother Miranda. Statement still applies. I'm sorry, am I going to be following little me around? Is that the vibe? Oh. Sage. Thanks. Oh no, your hands. Poor baby. Okay. I guess we'll keep following the soot. I'm still gonna check here. Hey, I remember this stupid abandoned car. First aid. Wait. Rose Love, did you write anything else? You did. Oh, you wrote a lot. So we finished Deeper Stratum. We'll start with Dad's voice, then. Those dolls were just unspeakably awful. Thank God Michael found me and got us out of there. The moment he brought me here, I felt better. And not just because I'm my usual size. I think this is actually the memory of my parents' old house. I don't remember this place myself, but it seems to be brimming with memories of my dad. I can really feel his love for me and how much hope he had for my future. You still have a future. Aw, baby. But yeah, Ethan literally died in the heart of it, so that makes sense. And Evelyn. According to Michael, the girl that's been terrorizing me is named Evelyn. I have no idea why, but she absolutely hates my guts. Yeah, because she wishes she were you. She wants what you have, and she blames you because she's really mentally a child and doesn't have a choice, but still. Should have seen this coming after that mass creep, but she was also lying about the crystal. Fool me once. But none of that matters now. I'm going to get this mold out of me. I'm going to get friends, and I'm going to be normal. This is just really sad. This poor child. Of course she's traumatized. Raining ooze. Hallelujah. Apparently spans two things. Michael pushed me out of the way. I think I've lost count of the number of times he saved me now. I don't know what's happened to him back there, but I have to press on. I have to find that crystal I know he'd want me to. This place isn't like anywhere else I've been. Those at least felt like they could exist in reality, but this is different. A strange sky dotted with these creepy black orbs, dripping ooze and all sorts of random junk. I have no idea where this is, but I do know the crystal's here somewhere. I can sense it. 
Can you? And also, are you not aware that your dad's name is Ethan? Because cause we made the connection. That wasn't... What, why is he going by Michael? I, whatever, he's being dramatic. That's Ethan, but sure. Okay. We'll continue. I guess we're going towards that thing. I don't like how it's pulsing, but, you know, it's probably... Great! More corpses in my past mistakes. Ugh. Just like in the castle. Yep, and we're gonna keep running into him, and I'm sorry. Oh, and we're still following me. And there's more. Wait. This is the masquerade masks. It's destroyed. Okay, <laughs> sure. This is still creepy. Oh, for fucks! Why am I fighting little me's? I don't want to do that. Oh my god. Of course we are. Because this wasn't traumatizing already. Come on, get off. Alright. Come on. There we go. Okay. Thank you, you're closer. No, stop moving. You horse. On. Down they go. Okay. Good, 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 good. Nothing like fighting yourself, eh, Rose? Nothing to it but to do it. Fucking hate this. You're gonna need so much therapy. Come on, let's go. Oh. Thank you for the handgun ammo that I just wasted missing half of those. Okay. Alright, little me. Where are you? Well, I guess me, me. Nice. They're coming from in there. Yeah. Because again, you've tried this before, apparently. I can't aim. And uh, most of those were headshots. That's an improvement. Shotgun ammo. Fuck yeah. Load that up for me. Okay. You're all set for that. But we're going to keep using the handgun for right now. Okay. Yeah, we'll keep going. Oh, there I am. There he is. <laughs> She's still fucking laughing? Thought we were done with her. You know what? Can you fall over already? There you go. Come on. There we go. Thank you for tipping over. Anything useful over here? Nope. Just me unaliving myself over and over again. Oh, this poor baby. And I once again ask, where the fuck is Mia? Why hasn't she been around? Why did you say that you haven't seen her in a long time? She's not dead. We know she's not dead. So where's she been? This girl needs her mum. Okay, uh... You got options, I guess. I mean... I just want to grab as much shit as possible. Oh wait, no, we came from here. Duh. Okay, so up here then. That's annoying. Alright. Let's do this. There we go. Alright, and counter it. Come on. Oh god, my face. My face gets really fucky when that happens. Come on, come on, back it up. go and reload oh fuck 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 come on come on come on are you serious get off of me i'm busy and reload my fucking gun whore feels weird to be calling myself a whore but you know it's fine um anyway we're kind of stuck there you go knock it off thank you stop it me i guess rose same thing for the sake of my sanity, me is Rose and Rose is me. Break it. There we go. Now let us in. Get, come on. Let's go. Okay. Ugh. I need to find that crystal. Yeah, yeah, we will. And we'll do our best anyway. How much you want to bet she ends up keeping her powers anyway? Plot. 
and she learns to love herself. Which would be wholesome. But, you know, then what's all this for? I guess memories. Okay, I'm gonna keep checking around. Wait. This is the same dive again. So we're not going to Sal's? Huh. Donna and Elsie got a little redox, but not the others. I guess this is the point of no return then? Okay. Yeah, I know, your ankles are kind of... Did you faceplant? Oh, poor baby. Okay. What the fuck? Why are the Dommy Trust bookshelves down here? What in the fuck is that? Did you write any more? No? I mean, understandable, you wouldn't really have time to write. What is this? Ugh, it's pulsing. Ugh. What? Is this where those uh, copies of me came from? I didn't even see that. This is a child. She's 16. It's weird. Oh, a typewriter. Good. Thanks. Come on. I'm sorry. That sounds like it fucking hurts, but your health is fine. So just save for me, please. Someone's been here. It's honestly probably you or the clone or whatever the fuck is going on here. Okay, shotgun. Thank you. First aid. Uh, what is this? I've been experimenting with the possibilities of manipulating and reviving the consciousness stored within the Megamycete. When a person dies, their consciousness is stored and preserved, but over time it becomes diffused and diluted, spread through and throughout the Megamycete mixed with other consciousness and memories. Extracting and reassembling an individual who is thus diffused has proved a monumental effort. As an experiment, I decided to see what would happen if I used different individuals' consciousness to create an entity. Results. Results were fascinating. I gathered fragments, respooled the threads, and succeeded in creating an individual birthed anew in this realm. A success to be sure, but while his unusual physique resembled a man I once knew, he was possessed of a deeply warped psyche and was missing a portion of his face. Conclusion. While manipulating memories to create a person is possible, the creations are flawed and unstable. It will not be possible to manufacture a suitable vessel in this way. This is Miranda's notes, then. I would think... Because she's making a vessel for Ava. Who wrote all this? all this? Probably Miranda. It would not surprise me, there's more. The Megamycete absorbs the memories of all life within its reach, but there are laws which govern this world within it. It seems worthwhile to catalog them as they become apparent. 1. The memories that comprise this realm do not strictly reflect reality. 2. Only those who are tuned to the Mutamycete in the life retain control of their faculties here in this realm. This aligns with my understanding of the Megamycete as revealed to me in its visions before my death. That's probably Miranda. And the man is probably the Duke, which is probably why he's acting like this and probably why he wears a mask. Because a portion of his face is probably missing. Yes, my death. My physical body is gone, absorbed into the Megamycete. And yet I do not despair for this phase granted me fascinating insights. All those years I strive, I continue to strive, they are not for nothing. The memories, the consciousness, understanding, and knowledge I have accumulated in life have transferred here to the Megamycete, where it serves as a source of power within this realm. If I can harness this power, I believe I can use it to affect the thoughts and memories of others. Of course, it's hardly a perfect arrangement. So many minds and memories gathered here, finding and retrieving a single person from amidst the rabble has proved an immense challenge. Her memories are here, yes, but dissolute. Perhaps what is needed is the right vessel into which to hold her. And of course, I know of the perfect vessel, the only real candidate in all my years of searching, Rosemary Winters. Yeah, this has to be Miranda's notes. She's still fucking around here somewhere. And she's still trying to use Rose to... Motherfucker. Fuck Mother Miranda. I keep saying it, but really, fuck Mother Miranda. Let it go. Oh my god, you're so irritating. You know that? Okay, we've read that. I think there's more here. Yep. I had intended to duplicate Rosemary Winters with the hope that a perfect replica might serve as a suitable vessel. However, the results were less than ideal. It would seem that some sort of interference is preventing me from creating a suitable rep replica. Instead, I have succeeded in what making what is essentially a living doll. It resembles the real thing, yes, but has no power. Such a pathetic husk could never prove a suitable vessel. I will continue my efforts in hopes of discerning the source of this interference. Several hypotheses have come to mind thus far. One, the fact that Rose herself is still alive. Well, yes. 
Two, some other actor within this realm. Might be Ethan. Three, a flaw in my methods of production. None of these seem especially likely to be the sole reason, nor are any of them easy problems to solve. Perhaps my best hope is to somehow bring Rose into this realm. Were she to offer herself as a vessel, it would be so simple. Yet why the fuck would she do that? Fuck you, you've literally fucked with her life ever since she was a baby. Additional observations. Further experiments with these Rose copies, as I've taken to calling these husks, have yielded another interesting wrinkle to pursue. When subjected to situations evoking extreme terror, they actually begin to express some semblance of Rose's abilities. This warrants more research, and I think that my first creation, the Max Duke, is just the one to perform the stress test. So he's still under Miranda's control, and he is the one that she made first, which is missing a portion of his face, which means that's not the Duke at all. That makes more sense. They couldn't have been watching me the entire time. Could they? I think they are. It would seem that at some point during my experiments with consciousness, an intruder made herself at home in my realm. This intruder was none other than the failure, Evelyn, who has been running about enacting her own pitiful agenda, which has led to a slight disruption in my own plans. Had Evelyn not interfered, Rosemary Winters would have been on the verge of despair, dispossessed of her will to live and her mutamicy powers. Instead, a new passion burns within her. I shall have to extinguish her. You leave her alone, Miranda. You've done enough. But I guess thanks, Evelyn. I resisted in that somehow. Okay, take the ammo. I don't know if we go down that way, but... We'll take all the ammo we can get. Are we reloaded all the way? I think... Yes, we are. Okay. Keep taking the stuff here, though. Take the sage. Honestly, we can use that whenever, but not now. I hear that. We don't go in there. Okay. That honestly makes so much sense, which means we're probably nearing the end. Which means I'm going to save again, because I'm a compulsive saver. Huh. How does this all end, then? I swear to God, if this kid gets hurt, I'm never gonna... Mm. I still has the answer, though. Where the fuck has Mia been? Okay, come on. Ugh. Jump scare? No. There's that feeling again. It's so strong. It must be the crystal. I don't... At this point, I don't know Almost if I trust there. that. Michael. Not Michael, but sure. That pull I've been feeling is close, but I just can't go any further. I thought I had made it when I saw that blue light, but no, not quite. If only I'd been braver, faster, stronger. So close. I was so close. There's the blue light. Uh-oh, be careful. Oh. And the crystallizing. This is the stuff that Alcy and the girls turned into. Will I see them again? I don't think they died close enough. Or, sorry, went dormant. I'm still in denial. It's, it's through fine. here. I. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't. You're gonna get hurt. I know you're gonna get hurt. Something bad's gonna ha. What the fuck? What the fuck? Why did you build a statue to whatever? What is this? Black God which lives in us and which we live. Create for us a new world as befits your will. Your dark consciousness holds us for a second chance, graciously offered and joyously accepted. You drink the blood of the lost lamb as it falls upon your darkened earth. Not to destroy, but to preserve and once again deliver unto life. She's not your lost lamb. She's a goddamn person. She just wants to be a normal kid. And you're a goddamn asshole. This is some twisted shit. Yeah, and it's all about you. see something up there, actually. Is that a variant for us? I don't know. This one's the real deal. I, I can feel it. No. It's not gonna be this easy. Oh, be careful.
Yeah, very funny. What do you want? Rose, I've waited so long for you. Who, who are you? My name is Miranda. What? You had become so powerful. Far too powerful for me to subdue directly. So, I had to lure you into this realm so that you might willingly relinquish your powers. No, but Kay said... Did he? Or did I? Again? That Kay was an illusion. Motherfucker! Very convincing, wouldn't you say? No way. Now you can become the vessel for my Eva! Ethan? Ethan, you pest! Ha! Ah! Stop. Stop the need for he can manifest. Get fucked, Miranda. He can save you, Rose! No one can. No! Rose! Come on! Rose, hurry. We're going, we're going, we're you going. You can't escape! Not from me! This is a terrible family reunion, but it's fine. No, come on, run. Dad, wait, hold up. Not the yes, time for this right conversation! Now. Run! Run! Thanks, Father! Hey, Ethan, long time no see. Missed ya. We'll catch up later. Uh, no! Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on! You're gonna be fine, let's go. Thanks. Why didn't you tell me who you really were? Yeah, what the fuck, dude? Why'd you let me call you Michael? I didn't want to complicate things. I just needed you safe. Complicate things? It would have clarified a lot of shit. Even though I knew it, but still. And I'm sorry I left you alone. But I had to find a way out. And I did. It's just ahead. Is it? Rose! No! <laughs> Your fucking hands off her! Come on! You're mine now. Ugh. Ew. Get away from my daughter. Ah, Stay get absolutely away fucked. from my family. Rose, come on. Come on, go, 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 go. She pulled the same fucking shit. The same shit with Mia again. No! You can't escape me, Ethan, persistent as always. Dad! Rose, now's your chance. Go live a normal life. Make friends. No one will ever call you a freak again. But... Rose, just go! I don't want to leave you! I know. I know. I love you. But I need to know that you're safe. So please, just... Ethan, you insolent pest! I got this. Get out of here. You're gonna destroy it, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. You know what? I'll take that. That one's accessible. Come on, let's do this. Fucking go! Powers will allow you to stand against me in the heart of my domain. Foolish little girl. 
Oh my god. With how intent you were on my throwing them away? I think they just might. Come on. There will be wailing and gnashing. No, there won't. Why <laughs> suffer needs? Nope. Okay. What's the plan here? What's the plan here? This will all soon be. I'm sure it will be. You are like this. Okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? Get this. And even if you were to survive, what would be the point? You can't save your father. You are of two different worlds. Uh-huh. Oh, rally? Oh, okay. Get absolutely wrecked, idiot! What is this? Get absolutely wrecked, that's what. <laughs> Come on. Fuck, 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 fuck. Where the fuck did she? <laughs> Come on. Okay, come on. Come on. Why do you fight? Well, you're not exactly mother of the year over here. This is... Yeah, I don't think so. This is nothing. Oh my god, you little shit. Come on. Come on, There's throw something at me again. Here I come. Well, thank you for announcing yourself. Bye. How about this? How about that? How about that instead? How about that, Let's huh? This. She can't. <laughs> She's getting absolutely fucking Impossible. dunked on. I think it's very possible. Come on, give me some more. Give me some more. It took so much to learn, but you're incredible. Well, ugh, why do you gotta say it like that? You're fucking creepy. You will fall. Come on, come on, come on. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Your time is up. I dodged that, but sure, 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 sure. This is a phase of some bullshit right no! now. Ugh, no. What the fuck are you on about? No, no, you're fucking weird. You're fucking creepy. That's mine, you creep. No matter how many Hey, yeah, 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 go on and on. You keep monologuing and monologuing. That's so annoying. It must be. You are the only one who can bring her back. No. Whatever it takes. Whatever I must do. I will see this through. Yeah? Do you, you sure about that? There is no happy ending. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, I love her. Ow, 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 ow. You will never be normal. Only I understand how special you are. No! You fucking creep. Leave her alone. She has a mother. And it's not you. How do you possess such power? Because fuck you, that's why. You just won't give up. You really are. Fuck yeah, she is. That stubborn life that shines inside you makes you the perfect best. How about no? How about get fucking wrecked? How about fucking die already? Sick of your shit. I'm sick of your shit. What is this? Death. <laughs> Come on, be careful, be careful, be careful. Come! Be by my side! No, you fucking creep! What? I'm absorbing, I'm idiot! <laughs> Where are you? Come on. Here I come. Uh, one, and two, you. and that's three, and that's mine. Uh, goodbye. Ow. Uh, owie. Sorry, Rose. I, I, I got, I got, 
I guess it's a little too funny. Um, anyway. Freaking, why won't it let me? Okay, here. Get her. Mine. Mine. Ow. Ow. I took that, but sure. Get her. Come on, how many bullets does it take? You're such a bitch. God damn. Impossible. Just empty the entire gun on your face. Huh? I shall give me more? finish this. How about you don't? Oh, there was ammo on the floor. What the fuck? Excuse there me? There is no victory. No! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. You're okay, you're okay, you're okay. Finally, my struggle comes to fruition. No, it doesn't. Come on. Grab this. You're gonna be okay. Rose, over here. Dad! Use this. Take her down. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Yo, we're gold as shit now! Come on, we got it! More later! Do this now! Oh, I will. Return and yield your strength to me! Absolutely not! Get wrecked, idiot! Where's my gun? So much power! You truly would have been the perfect vessel for my Eva! Uh, Fucking die I'm already! Not goddamn vessel! Not some stupid copy! I'm me! Rose! And you're done! <sighs> Get the fuck out of here, Miranda! Oh, fucking insane. Hey! Who is your dad? Hey, sweetie. Hey, uh... Oh my god! You're, you're so grown up now. Even though I wasn't there with you, I've always watched over you. I'm so sorry, I couldn't protect you. All you've ever done is protect me. No. Not this time. You lost your chance. I'm so sorry. No. It was my choice. And I don't regret it one bit. If I had left you, then we never would have had this chance to talk face to face. Welcome back. I'm back. You are back. Welcome back. Oh, you can't see, but I'm crying right now. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> I'm back. Oh 
Oh my god, tell me she gets to see Mia later. Where is her mom? I'm fucking... You can't see, because again, no face... I'm literally crying right now. Oh, storybook's done. It is ring fits your... <laughs> oh. <laughs> Do you think the little boy will be able to touch the This moon? is what happened well, before! What if the moon is too far away? Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay. Then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. This is what happened before that, because this plays at the end of Village! So all Fever that was before! I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like it. And then we're visiting the grave. Oh, that scene has so much more now. That's why you're wearing the ring. Because you went into the my seat and you got it. The scene is even sadder now. But once again, where the fuck is Mia? Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. <laughs> On this Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. <laughs> yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. Yeah, fuck you, no. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. Had <sighs> a girl. We have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. <laughs> She's just a kid. Oh, that makes sense now. Way to keep it together, Rose. No, honestly deserved. No one gets to call you that, not after what you just went through. You're a lot like him, you know? Good. I know. Oh, the timeline makes sense now, but again, where the fuck is Mia? Where's her fucking mom? And who the fuck is that walking in the distance? I didn't know that all of that happened before the grave visit in the epilogue of Village. So do we get more or is this it? No? Oh, no we don't. Well, I guess I'll sit through this um, and see if there's an egg credit scene, but that... Is the end of Shadows of Rose DLC unless there's a post credit scene, then if there is, you'll see it. But if not, this is where I leave you with that. I'm not kidding. I know you can't see. I, I know, because I, I don't really face cam anymore. I could not handle that. I fucking started crying. Honestly? I I'm fucking chill with this catharsis again. It had the same effect at the end of Village, but this is so much worse because, like, all the generations together. Literally just seeing this little girl that we carried around, that we protected as a baby, all grown up now, and fuck the dude that called her Evelyn extra fucking hard now, because fuck you, not after what she just went through, but that makes sense now. And fuck Mother Miranda, always. She literally pulled the same trick that she did with Mia, who. I still want to know where the fuck she is and why... Why isn't Rose, like, you know, having her by her side to, like, go through stuff together and giving her some kind of comfort with all this? Like, where the fuck is Mia? I don't know. But honestly, I I'm okay with the way that this ended. I thought we were going to go through every lord again, but I think the lords that we did go through did make sense. Alcy's place was a little lackluster this time around, but I think that was more, again, focusing on introducing um, lore and things. But honestly, very well done. Donna's section was the most frustrating and my favorite. But that ending, oh, I'm not gonna be okay for a while, but it's like a good cry. That was catharsis. And that was so 
well done. Thank you so much whoever happens to be watching this like and subscribe. It really does help me out. Until next time. Bye. And bye, little Rose. I hope you get to play again soon. That's the end. Green Teen and Serene Teen were the Steam achievements I got for that. Completed in almost four hours. Oh my god. Alright. See you in like a year. <laughs>